eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight, robots, fight. Oh, good speed right out of the box by Whittle by Whittle. He takes it first to, uh, to pin. Now here comes Pummel. Oh. Oh, and Pummel's come around to the back of Whittle by Whittle. See the wheelies that uh, that Whittle by Whittle is doing there as it moves backwards. Very common with this Sawbot design. Yeah, one of the challenges with the Sawbot action is that as that as that arm is moving, it's changing the physics of your robot. So uh, what you really want to do is kind of pick an ele- like uh, pick an angle. Oh, and it comes down. Whittle by Whittle is is on top of Pummel. That was a good pin there. Ouch. Good sawing action. Bryce is able to get back onto uh, onto his wheels. Two similarly designed robots. Very similar, yeah. Kind of, kind of like a similar weapon, but really different driving style and different builds. Minibot on Minibot here in the corner, and oh, Sawbot on there Sawbot. It is. Wow! Whittle by Whittle doing exactly what it's designed to do right there in the corner. We see a little bit of smoke from Whittle by Whittle. What is that smoke from? You can see those wheelies that Whittle by Whittle pops up until that saw gets all the way back into position. Whittle by Whittle, not a hammer saw. It's not looking for a lot of speed with that arm. It wants nice, slow, Oh, it's controlled. coming down, Kyle. Oh! oh and Pummel escaped. escaped right at the last second. Whittle by Whittle trying to jockey into position. Get Pummel into that corner so they can take some more hits on it. 60 seconds left in this fight. And Whittle by Whittle has now just like uh, come down into that. Oh my God, look at all of those sparks! That beautiful shower of sparks. Oh, I love to see a Sawbot. In action, Kyle. Oh, and Bryce has pinned Pummel one more time. You can see cuts on the bottom plate of Pummel. Oh, and Bryce has done it again. That's another really good pin. 20 seconds left here. This one will very likely go to the judges. One more self-right from, from Whittle by Whittle. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. That's the match. Turn off your weapons, drive to the door, round of applause. This one goes to the judges. Before we get to the judges, I wanna wish a happy uh, four year wedding anniversary to pin and pummel drivers. Casey Germayason and Casey Germayason. Wow, congrats, yeah. guys. Two Casey's met one another. They uh, got married. And, and then uh, built some robots. Yeah. That's now, awesome. uh, now the bills that get sent to the house, who knows who has to pay which one. All right. Um, okay, let's start with Jack. Jack, your thoughts on this. Whittle by Whittle versus Pin and Pummel. Uh, Whittle by Whittle was in control for the duration of the fight and they were the only bot that really got any offense in so that my vote goes to Whittle by Whittle. All right we've got one vote for Whittle by Whittle. How about you Andrew? Uh, Same boat there you look at the damage on um, Pummel and you know there's cuts in that carbon fiber top panel bottom panel. Uh, Whittle was able to control better and get those pins in than damage so overall Whittle by Whittle for me. All right. Two votes for Whittle by Whittle. And uh, Don, take us home. Yeah, I'm going with the Whittle by Whittle. All, All right. right. Got a unanimous judge's decision for Bryce Yankaskis and Whittle by Whittle. Um, I would love to, uh, to to talk to the pin and pummel uh, builders and drivers at some point. So uh, if they hear us and they're interested, maybe go and find Chris. You yeah. know, I would love to. Because I love their story, rookies, brand new uh, robots and uh, really big fans of Norwalk Havoc. 
who drove all the way here from Minneapolis to build and, and drive this first time robot. That's awesome. All right, uh, we've got action here in cage one. I see them all loaded up. We've got Deluxe Ray versus Stinger. Box is locked. Are these drivers ready to go? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight! Robots fight! Oh, oh, big pop in the air on Deluxe Ray. And Stinger is looking absolutely chonky right now, yeah, Kyle. Yeah, that weapon on Stinger is just vicious. Winner's bracket round three. These bots have already beat other robots earlier today. And uh, we are seeing some really good increased reliability from Stinger. I mean, their second outing out here at Norwalk Havoc is looking so good. Finding those angles, getting around to where they want to be, and uh, popping Deluxe Ray in the air. Deluxe Ray took a long time to self right there, and they're already back over on their head. <laughs> oh! oh! Deluxe Ray says, we're not, uh, we're not gonna have uh, Bert help you out here. I, I can help you down. You don't need a save. Oh no, they might! Look at that! That's two in a row from Cody, who uh, very helpfully helped uh, Deluxe Ray back down. But Deluxe Ray really is spending a lot of time on its head. Uh, almost this entire fight. All right. About halfway oh, now it's match. stuck on that side. That's the side that they have a really hard time I getting off of. I think they have one save left. Yeah, they've they got their do. one save. Yep, so that's it. That's their save. That is three times in a row that they've been stuck in that, that one uh, angle. All right. Oh, no, you got to hit the button. Hit you got to hit the button. That is a tap out. Oh, gosh. That is a tap out. Yeah, 